Hey y'all, it is Lady C. Yes, and we have made it to Cinco de Mayo. Hey, we may be stuck in the house, but guess what? We're still going to have some good old fun on Cinco de Mayo. Anyway, my daughter went and got us some margaritas. Here is, um, I guess this is just a regular margarita, but it has lime in it. And then we've got some Jose Cuervo in the house. And then we've got strawberry. Look at that, you guys. One of our local bars um, was selling the margaritas. Yes, yeah, so we got those. Um, these are the seasonings we use because we're also doing our version of Mexican spare ribs. Hubby used this um, mojo sauce that we have. Uh, here's some other mojo sauce. And here's some adobo. He just used some chipotle, which I don't see up here. This sauce, that sauce is chipotle. Oh, okay. It's chipotle, according to my husband. Here's some lime we're using. Cumin. We use some paprika. Oregano. We've got cinnamon and sugar. So these are some items we use to marinate our Mexican olives. What would Cinco de Mayo be without making our dip? Um, I make a basic nacho dip, hubby made it this time. Turkey meat, um, some salsa con queso. We always use Tostitos. And we use Rotel tomatoes, diced tomatoes. Um, I use mild. And um, that's how we do it. We put it in a crock pot and let it go. Cook your meat up. Huh? I've got the taco seasoning. Oh, and a pack, we also use a pack of taco seasoning. So there's our nacho dip. We're gonna have, I've got some Tostitos we're gonna use for that. We also have, we use this Agoya yellow rice and red beans. Um, we did add a few things to it. I'll show you guys. We added some corn and some Rotel tomatoes. And here's our end product. This is our rice and beans with tomato and some fresh corn cut up in it. Yes, there we go. Doesn't matter. And then we're just basically, we had a um, old El Paso taco kit. Um, we're also going to let the kids make some regular tacos. Here's just ta uh, turkey meat with um, taco seasoning in it. And that's basically going to be our meal, you guys. Um, the kids like the scoops, so we'll use this for the nacho dip. And um, hubby's got the ribs in the oven um, going, so we're ready. We'll be ready to eat in a little bit. Hope everybody having a good Cinco de Mayo, because we are going to enjoy ours. Love all y'all. Cyber hugs. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Lady C, signing out. Yes, 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 yes. All right, you guys. Excuse me. All right, you guys. Here's our finished Mexican ribs for Cinco de Mayo. Oh, no, look at that, you guys. They are marinated, beautiful, and we are about to eat these up. See y'all later. Bye-bye.